We can meditate everywhere, anytime. Even three seconds, two seconds, while you're walking, while you're having coffee and tea, while you're having meeting, so you can meditate. Many people has a little bit of misunderstanding about meditation. They think meditation meaning think of nothing, concentrate. <laughs> so push too much. So we cannot block thought and emotion. In fact, we need thought and emotion. So whether you listen to your monkey mind or not, that's an issue. What I call monkey mind, mind is chatting, you know, pala 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 yada yada. So monkey mind is giving you opinion. So whether you listen to opinion or not, it's up to you, right? So through meditation, what we do is we have to make friends with the monkey mind. But how to make friends? Just giving banana doesn't work, you know? <laughs> so right method is you need to give job to monkey mind. How to give job monkey mind? So the simple meditation technique is be aware of the breath. So you ask monkey mind, hello, what's breath? So monkey mind says, ah yeah, good idea. And be aware of breath. Breathing in, breathing out, breathing in. There's a lot of thought comes at the background. Don't care, no problem. So as long as if you not forget your breath, anything is okay. No need too much concentration. Just simply be aware of your breath. Breathe in, out, in. Even two breath, one breath. So therefore, we can meditate everywhere, anytime. In the past, the mysterious Qigong was regarded as mystical or even as magic by some. But studies have found that the Qi movements within the body can be tracked by a heat detector. So what are we learning today? Qi. Internal energy. The essence of life. It moves inside of us, flows through our bodies, give us power from within. My message to the youth is this. You should obtain the 12 jewels of life no matter what. And the 12 jewels of life are knowledge, wisdom, understanding, freedom, justice, equality, food, clothing, shelter. And after that, love, peace, and happiness. Peace. If you are happy within you, happiness which is connected with wisdom, not only depend on outside circumstances, then it's good for your life and then your environment, your, your lifestyle, your life, your job, your study, everything become good. How we can find this happiness? Uh, within you, yeah? And how? Two things, through, through two things, what we call wisdom and method. Wisdom is to know your true nature, nature of yourself, nature of phenomena. Knowing the truth is liberating from suffering. Another one is method, like skillful means love, compassion and also meditation is very good if you just to join together you can really develop happiness within you thank you